easier. <laughs> Watch out for the Rogue Rebel 3000! Nico! Look at that! Hey, guys! Come see what Annabella made! Whoa! Whoa! It's a masterpiece! Do you really like it? I made it from lots and lots of modeling clay. It's amazing. You should put it somewhere we can always see it. Can I keep it on top of the clubhouse porch? That's the perfect spot. Come on, guys. Let's move it. One, two, three, lift. Ah! <laughs> ah! This thing must weigh a hundred tons. If it's so heavy, how did you manage to bring it here, Annabella? I made it here. I know how to move it. One of those big, whatchamacallits. A bulldozer. Sweet. Where would we get one big enough to move this? I've been reading about Easter Island. It's a place with these big stone statues called Moai. Hundreds of years ago, the islanders carved them at this spot in the middle of the island. They're so big. And heavy. As heavy as seven cars. But get this. After they carve them, they move them down to the shore, like 22 kilometers away. How? They wouldn't have had big machines. Nobody knows how. Wouldn't it be cool to solve a famous mystery like that? Yeah. And if we knew how they moved their big statues, then we'd know how to move Annabella's. Let's go try to move one of those big heads and solve the big mystery. It's expedite! This says the Moai are protected by law because they're so special and old. The rule is no touching the big head. Then how do we figure out how they moved them? No problem. We have our own big heavy thing to experiment with. Otto and I can be the expedition team. We'll go to Easter Island and look for clues about how they moved those statues. And the rest of us can be the home team. We can use what you guys learned to move our statue. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah! You can say it now. It's expedition time! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Also known as Rapa Nui. I'm so excited I'm on the edge of my seat. Me too. I think I'm a little bigger than your usual co-pilot. Look, I see the Moai. Cool, but they're protected, so you better not land too close. Hmm, try over there at the quarry. and a perfect place to start our investigation. Wow, so this is where the statues were carved? Yeah, and some of them are still here. Let's tell the others. What's that thing? A little something Mindy and I've been working on. May I? Oh, it's a stand for the team tab. I call it a hands-free communication system. I asked Mundy to set up the other half back at the clubhouse. Expedition team to home team. Come in. Can you see us? <laughs> a little too well. Can you move back? All I can see is your nose. Okay. Wow. Look at the size of those statues. They're way bigger than mine. How could anybody move them without bulldozers? According to my book, the people who lived here used to say the statues walked to the shore. Like this? Moai. 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 <laughs> Walking statues? That's what you call detective work? 
Okay, so they didn't walk. Maybe people carried them. But they're huge! Who could carry them? Giants? Hmm. A little to the left. <laughs> Guys, statues don't walk and giants don't exist. I think Vico found the answer. Huh? Abracadabra! Abracadorch! Move this statue to the porch! Oh, Vico! Try this, Vico! Abracadabra! Abracadare! Make this statue as light as air! Abracadabra! Abracadabra! Huh? On second thought, we don't have the answer. Gabby, you're on to something! If they tied a rope to one of the moai, then a lot of people could pull at once. That might work. Let's try! Come on! Pull! Pull! <laughs> Did we move it? Wait! I just had a genius idea! Mundy! Remember how we lifted the tire swing? <gasps> we used a tree branch to take some of the weight. Right! We used a pulley! It's a type of simple machine. Let's try it! Ah! <laughs> Maybe that's how they stood up the Moai. Yeah, let's go look at the ones that are standing up. A pulley would definitely help stand that guy up. Only one problem, no trees. What would they attach a pulley to? Maybe there used to be trees. Maybe, but even then, pulleys only pull up. We still don't know how they moved it from back there all the way over here. Hmm. Whoa! <laughs> Did you see that? Sorry, runaway pencil. No, did you see how the pencil rolled me? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, and it's another genius idea. The people of Easter Island must have used giant slingshots. <laughs> Otto, remember, there were no giants. Maybe they rolled the statues on something. Good idea! I'll get all my pencils. Our statue is too heavy for pencils. We need something bigger. Something that can roll. Something like a Road Rebel 3000? Oh, Vico! That's even better than your magic idea! Guys, we have a plan. We're going to lift Annabella's statue onto Vico's skateboard. Don't start with that! Your genius expedition team is heading home. Uh, geniuses, did you forget something? Huh. Let's go! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Neat! Now give it a try. Come on! Let's all push! Up this ramp! <laughs> now we just have to get it on top of the porch. Mundy? One pony coming up! of Easter Island. Well, they didn't have skateboards back then. No, but now we do know they could have used simple machines to make the work easier. And we also know why they put them next to the water. Why? Because after all that hard work, I need a swim.